Hello and welcome. If you like today's tutorial, please like and subscribe. It really does help. This is just a follow up from my previous tutorial using a metahuman in a third person template. In my pursuit of creating tutorials that a novice can follow, sometimes I reduce things so much that mistakes happen. I'm so concentrated on getting it as easy as possible that I'm, I, it, it will go wrong. And in this case, in the previous tutorial, the foot IK broke for those more advanced users. And what I want to say is that sometimes you have to do more in order to achieve the correct results. And that's what this video is. We're going to fix the foot IK and I'm not going to do it in a way that a beginner can follow along. This will be more for an intermediate user. Okay. So in the previous tutorial, we assigned a skeleton metahuman. Let's go to our metahuman Ada. Just refresh your memory. Here she is. And we assign the mannequin skeleton. Now, you will have seen the new functionality for compatible skeletons inside Unreal Engine 5. I didn't do it that way because I was trying to keep the IK bones, but in the end, it didn't matter. It, it, it just, it didn't matter because I suddenly realized later in the evening, if we go to this skeleton and we click on this, the IK bones, say for example, we bring up the preview mesh. Uh, can we access the skeleton here? Yeah, look. So this bone only exists in the skeleton, but not on the skeletal mesh. So it doesn't matter if you do it this way because those IK bones still will not work. So I should have noticed that, but I was just trying to, as I said, I was trying to simplify it for beginners and, and, and I thought I'd found a way but I was wrong about that so what we're going to do is fix the foot IK let's do that now and I'm going to stop rambling first we come to our SK mannequin skeleton on the root bone create a virtual bone and select root name this IK foot root so now we have a VB IK foot root Right click on that virtual bone and type foot and choose our left foot and name this IK foot L and then right click on the virtual bone root again and search for foot R. Okay, and then name this IK foot R. Okay, and then hit save. Then what we need to do is go back to our um, mannequin basic foot IK control rig that we changed in the last tutorial. Set the root bone to pelvis. We set it to animation root in the last one. We'll not be doing that this time. And then come over to the rig hierarchy here and right click refresh and from here choose Quinn and choose this Quinn not Quinn simple Quinn and it will refresh just give a moment there we go and now what that will do is refresh this rig hierarchy and show our virtual bones we just created that's what we need before we proceed any further, come over here to preview scene and in the preview mesh, find the metahuman body that you're working with. In our case, it is this F medium NRW preview, like so. And then here, I want you to find the virtual bones we just created. So VB IK foot left and then VB IK foot R. Hit compile. 
save and now when we hit play we should in theory have foot ik again Now, it is not perfect, I understand that, but this is the closest I can get with doing it this method. So, what I would suggest for the more advanced users is play around with the control rig until you get the desired results. I am just showing you how far I went. I am well out of my comfort zone with all this. I do not use Unreal Engine 5 for creating games so i rarely have a need for foot ik because i can just hide feet off camera where you can't see them when they're not touching the ground uh, but yeah there we go so a short but sweet follow-up and hopefully that'll fix your foot ik problems if you do have any more problems comment in the comments section i am now going down a path where i am not comfortable the, the game development stuff i am not comfortable with it if if i uh, have things like uh, chaos destruction and things that i will use in cinematics i will be doing tutorials on things like that in the future uh, so parts of game development will crop up in my video but this kind of thing it's just it's not something that i would think about for ik and and etc um maybe i should maybe i should because here i am talking away and i'm actually quite enjoying doing this <laughs> anyway that's it for today thanks for watching please like and subscribe and there is a, a link in the description to buy me a coffee and believe me i really need one after this thanks for watching bye bye